Kirsten Austin, a pediatric nurse, says she's trained on what to do in an emergency at her physician's office, but she never thought she'd use those tools blocks from her front door. So it was right in front of their house. A five-year-old kindergartner was hit at 81st and Boyd Tuesday. Austin says when she noticed all the cars and people outside screaming, she announced she was a nurse and there to help. The gal who had accidentally hit her handed her to me in her arms and I just walked over in the grass, sat her down, made sure she was breathing, mm -hmm. which she was, thank goodness. She comforted the little girl as they waited for paramedics to arrive, but Austin says it was scary. I would say in and out of consciousness, not moving, um, eyes closed, kind of just whimpering. Mm -hmm. Yeah, whimpering and uh, in and out of eyes open and closed. When the fire trucks came, eyes opened. She still didn't move, but you could tell she was very scared. The child was eventually taken to a hospital with critical injuries. A family member I spoke with says the little girl is doing much better today, but there is still a long road of healing ahead. It's unclear what led up to the crash, but Austin says it looked like she was playing with other children. So I think other kids witnessed it happen, and that's going to be very traumatic. Austin says she wasn't planning on being out that late, and the crash happened close to sunset. And I'm glad I took a half an hour to talk to my neighbors because otherwise I wouldn't have been up here. I would have been done with my walk.